What's good, YouTube? Real Estate Gaming here. So today we're gonna be checking out a short horror story by Pop Tar Guap. It is titled The Secret Formula. Now I'm not knowledgeable of what this is about, other than it's related to SpongeBob. So let's go ahead and uh, read this little brief right here. For all time, the Krabby Patty Secret Formula was now in Plankton's hands, not realizing until it was too late that some secrets were better left unheard, knowing now of the atrocities left unspoken within Bikini Bottom. Plankton must now do what he must do to restore justice, should he vigilant enough to retain his sanity. Damn, that sounds crazy to me. So uh, let's go ahead and react to uh, parts one through seven that this Charlie CETN guy put together for us. And then we're gonna react to eight through 12, which is the end of the series on the main uh, creators page. Warning. Oh, y'all been warned, man. Yeah! Oh, like he got the secret crabby, secret crabby petty formula in his hands. But it seems like he's seen something. And left him baffled. Oh, it says plank. Oh, it said like... Hold on, let's go back. Let's read that secret uh, formula. It says secret formula for crabby patties. Anchovies, Gary Slime, crab meat... Chum, plankton, sponge, and tuna. Tuna, <laughs> what the heck? I've heard of the stories of this before, but now that this confirms it, I'm kind of scared. Oh my god, what's up with Mr. Krabs? He's gonna be looking crazy. Yo. Alright, that is terrific, man. SpongeBob! SpongeBob! It's gonna be SpongeBob boy. Oh no, his door's open. No, he might be too late, man. SpongeBob. Don't tell me he can sponge me, boy. <laughs> why? Oh, God, why? oh, things are not looking too good. Oh, it's Gary. Or Spongebob's shoe. Bro, Gary was... It's over, Karen. His Krabs son, his shell was cracked. I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to. I am sorry, Sheldon. But Krabs cannot get away with this. You have to do something. Krabs has access to all the Bikini Bottom CCTV. And so do I. If we play this right, we can find Spongebob. Alright, so Spongebob might still be alive. That's good. But R.I.P. Gary, though. Cameras. This one has been elicited. Shut off. It's been located within an underground storage unit in Rock Bottom. If there's one place where Clabs would have ducked someone, it would be there. Oh. So you might be keeping SpongeBob captive? You can communicate with me through it, but you're going to have to insert the bracelet, Con. Pete, into the circuit breaker so I can restore power to the camera. You're not letting me go into Rock Bottom alone, are you? Unfortunately. If you want power restored. Come on, Plankton, you're a savage, bro. We don't know what happened to him. We may have very little time. Exactly, you gotta respond now. Yeah, you'll know if Spongebob's inside. Take this tablet with you. I'll show you inside the storage room once the power is restored. Alright, it's all up to you, little Plankton. You must go now, I'm believing you, man. Take the next bus to the bottom. I'll guide you from there. SpongeBob needs you. So no, he's going to rock bottom. We all know we'll go down to rock bottom, bro. It's like going to the hood. Four blocks straight. Your destination should be on your left. Oh, look at those people, bro. Almost there. That building on your left. I think I can see the circuit breaker, Karen. Okay, Sheldon, that empty slot. You're going to have to insert me into that. I guess this is it. You'll be alright. Do it now. Get the tablet ready. See, that was that wasn't too hard, Plankton. Just overthinking, yes. man. Easy peasy. Don't let me down, Karen. Please. Oh, oh Neptune! SpongeBob! Oh, he's like shackled up. SpongeBob! SpongeBob! Oh, oh man, Neptune. you look busted, oh, bro. Neptune. I'll get you out of here, SpongeBob. Who is the light? Don't. Please. Damn, do not turn the light on, bro. Please, no. I don't want to see what they've done to Sponge Me, boy. <sighs> oh, what? You like ripped off all his Neptune. flesh for the Krabby Why? Patty. Why, Plankton? This is what wicked, did he do man. to you, SpongeBob? It doesn't 
matter. Crabs will just keep harvesting my sponge as long as I'm breathing. Oh, Neptune. Dude. That's so much. <laughs> it's so dark. I'm sorry, Plankton. You were never the bad guy. <coughs> you. I should have never listened to Crabs. I never meant you harm, Plankton. I never meant to hurt anyone in the big huge bottom. I promise. <laughs> I mean, how can a guy that Please, that's mob be a bad guy, you know? If you could just be good to me, just this once, and pull the switch behind you, you could end the suffering, truly. Oh could no. Could end my pain and set me free. I mean, if that's I'm just, begging you, Plankton. If that's the SpongeBob Please. once, then. Please. Do it so. Oh man. Oh, there's a kill switch. I'm sorry, Plankton. It shouldn't be you. But you can be my friend. Where's Patrick? For just one moment, right? Please help me just this once. Save me and pull the switch. Where the heck is Patrick's star, man? It's okay. I can't. Yes. Yes, you can. Just take a deep breath. Can't and do this. Save me. How oh, did he do it? I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, peace, sponge me, boy. Dang. I mean, I guess it was better to put him out of his misery. He was suffering a lot. <clears throat> <laughs> Damn, look at that. He's fried. The deep fried sponge. Oh. Oh no. I think Mr. Krabs knows he's there. Hey, somebody please help. No, let me out. Curse you, Neptune. Why, you bastard god. Why me? No. No. Oh, that's supposed to be surprise. Come on, Plankton. All these years thinking the formula would sausage your business. No. It was never about the Krusty Krab. It was about those fish brains and bikini bottom. You're a vile, worthless crab. Scraping Tell every him, penny to fill that pathetic void inside your shell. I saw what's inside that formula. You stole everything from me, you bastard. Let him know what's up, Plankton. You found some formula. Cost. The price is worth more than every penny I've ever made. And now you're going to pay. Mr. Krabs is an evil You're evil not man. getting away with this. Of course I am. Yeah, the monster that killed SpongeBob. You killed SpongeBob, you worthless crab. I never pulled the switch, Plankton. <laughs> does have a point, but no. Now I shall continue my work to continue pleasing my customers. The riches of Krusty Krabs shall be bountiful, something you have yet to understand. And as for you, make yourself comfortable. There's nothing your little plankton body can do against we and four still. Damn, so now he's trapped in there? Until you have one like my boy SpongeBob. Goodbye, Plankton. No, no, he's trapped in there with dead SpongeBob. I would not want to be trapped in there with the dead body. <laughs> All right, so that is the end of uh, part one through seven. Now we're gonna go to Marcus Youth Channel, which is the original creator of the series, and we're gonna watch parts eight through 12. And this is part eight, Plankton's Lament. Sheldon? Oh, Karen to the rescue? Oh, damn, look at Plankton, bro. He's like on his last straw. That boy needs some milk. Sheldon! Oh, Neptune, Sheldon. Get up, Sheldon. Please wake up. Just give him some milk, bruh. Oh, mercy. Oh, she's in SpongeBob. Oh, darling. Bro, he's missing an arm and a leg. I'm here, Sheldon. Oh, Neptune, I'm so sorry. It looks, uh, took so long to, uh, to get here. Please forgive me. What happened? You're here. Oh, you're here. 
I'm going to get you out of here, Sheldon. This is getting emotional very fast. Toxins, toxins, then leak from SpongeBob's corpse. Crabs put inside him. They made my limbs rot. Come on, stay with me. Nah, don't tell him he's gonna die. I, I'm sorry for always causing you trouble, the chum bucket. I just wanted to make us happy. Oh, Sheldon, please don't. I'm going to get you out of here, and we're going to get through this together. Come on, Sheldon. Plankton, stay with me. Please, Sheldon. Damn, this is sad, bro. Alright, that is the end of part 8. Now let's go to part 9. Uh, Revenant. In the remote shelter. She's gonna rescue him, I know that. Come on, Sheldon, stay with me. I feel so bad for Plankton. Please let this work. Yeah, because back at the chum bucket, they'd be having like all these uh, computers and whatnot. So I'm sure this is going to be successful. You gave your life, Sheldon, all those years ago. Please let me give you yours. You got this, Karen. This is the first time I ever root for a Karen. Okay, uh, it's powering up. <laughs> please, please work. Oh, okay, part nine. Let's, I mean, uh, let's go to part ten. Vengeance. Oh, that sounds like a spicy title. Oh, Sheldon, you're awake. What? Where am I? Oh, he's a cyborg now. Look at that. Our shelter away from Crab's side. You're safe. As for your body, this was all I could do to save you. I'm so sorry if you don't like it. Please understand this. This is the best I could do. I was just remembering everything turning dark and then immeasurable pain. I don't know how. Oh, Neptune, my arms and legs. Please just relax. You built me one shot and remember. All those years ago, you gave me life. Showed me what it meant to be alive. This was the best I could do. The same for you. Thank you, darling. Where is Krabs now? He's at the Krusty Krab right at this moment. I just checked CCTV earlier. He's going to start closing up uh, shop for the day. While well, I have the strength, then I should put the end to this now. But Sheldon, I would not let another innocent soul be tortured by crabs. All our lives, are, all our lives, Karen, we've raged pursued by evil. It is now turned to wrath towards the worst of all evil. Then what do you uh, suggest, Sheldon? Now, what are you gonna do, bro? Crab pays his dues. <laughs> he will pay. For, uh, for by the wrath of Neptune, I shall make him repent. Ooh, that sounds cool. For SpongeBob. Yeah, for SpongeBob, a boy. I'm still, I'm still in awe that SpongeBob actually died. That's crazy, man. All right, this is part 11, the Rise of Sheldon. Always played by his rules. Played it fair. It's time he plays against my rules. Sheldon, I don't want anything to happen to you, to us. You can go get like a mech suit or something. I just know this. I know these things, man. Nothing will ever erase those images in my head. Nothing will ever repair the hole in my gods out of my soul. I will show him how to play fair. If this is what it comes down to, then so be it. Oh, I knew it, bro. You got a mech suit. Look at that. Let it be the last time crap walks through those forsaken doors. Well, that's the end of the Krabby Patty, I guess. The last time he counts his damn change and lives to see another day. For I shall be a soldier, a soldier of Neptune and rage with his vengeance. Dude, this is building up like immensely. <laughs> it's epic. All right, and for the final part, uh, part 12, the end of Eugene. No, it's gonna end already, man. I don't want it to end. Ah, another bountiful day. Look at that menace. Hey, is that a plank his arm? Oh, they grabbed him by the neck. They mean business, bro. 
No, stop. Ah, look at him. Oh, he ripped his arms off. Dang, no mercy. That's what I'm talking about. Love to see it, man. Arr, arr, it's hilarious how it took you so this long. Oh my god, it looks demonic, dude. SpongeBob suffered, suffered beyond comprehension. And now you shall pay. And you'll never get him back ever. It's already over, Sheldon Plankton. Do what you must, but the games are over. It made me fortune that this insufferable brat SpongeBob is gone. Condemn me as much as you wish. Nothing will ever replace that greedy bird behind your worthless shell. Curse you, Plankton. I was never that envious low-life insect that you are. You can only dream of me success, and that'll haunt you forever. None of it matters anymore. It all ends tonight. You're nobody. You've never been anything. Rotten how, insect. Damn. I am nobody. But Spongebob wasn't. He was the best cook in Bikini Bottom, man. Chim on this. You, <laughs> you crustaceous. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, cool. He got a sword. Nice. Slice him in half, bro. Look at that. That is a nightmarish image right there. Holy crap. Hey, look at this. Vengeance. This is so cool, man. Goodbye, Eugene. Dude. This was insane. Holy crap, dude. This little uh, secret formula horror short story was better than I expected. And the imagery to it is like top notch, dude. Like I, I can't even, I can't even, uh, I don't have any words for it. Like it's so well made together and the storyline well put together. Um, well, shout out to Mar uh, Marcus Yu for the awesome short story. Hopefully we get more of him in the future because this, uh, this was top notch entertainment and I would love to see more of this. And I'll link all the videos down below in the description if you guys want to check them out for yourselves as well for his, uh, his channel. And thank y'all for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.